Once again, from Singapore, I was just walking by, trying to recall something for the way to find a mosque. And you just land in Jalan Basar until I come into this gathering of all the security in the area. Greetings. I might not be, but it is a security training session. It's not the police. Okay, I'll show you. Hello! It's not the police, it's the security guys. It's a private security guys. So it's a large gathering over. It. So I needed to be recorded. The one is a salamat. Ari Aya. Eden for three green things oh. and this one. So therefore, I really did not want to, to start the video from here. But when I saw that large gathering of the police, I just could not resist. Because when I start video taping, I don't like to add anything, no editing, just an instruction. So I just straight away give it to the audience. Because the best camera is the, be the camera you have. You capture the moment. So I could not resist, but I could always start from. The security guard. So the idea is uh, there is nothing ever. Hey, there is never hey, is, uh, ever anything wrong with it. What do you feed your tape? So what is the crossing? The crossing is true. So there is never is uh, a bad video. That's what I'm saying. There is never is a bad feeling. There is always. So, just capture the moment. It doesn't matter where it's coming from. But make sure you watch the traffic. You have 20 seconds. 20 seconds to cross the road. This one hasn't been indicated. But, uh, <laughs> so yes, 15, 16. Yes, and it counts down. Anna, and. Uh, <laughs> The reason I laughed is that I saw an, uh, a toilet, two minutes toilet in Dubai. You put the money in and then it gives you two minutes and then somebody shouts, get out of the toilet, get out of the toilet. So in here, you have two minutes. Salamu alaikum, Eid Mubarak. So you have uh, and, uh, the traffic. In Indonesia, in Mal Indonesia, the traffic will not stop for you. It is just keep going and keep going until... So it is not very wise to feed your tape when you are in Indonesia and you are in the street. Indonesia, the way the taxis will stop for you, people are very polite. In here, the streets are very narrow. Regardless of let's, what we're trying to locate is the Asr prayer time. And uh, we are in. So let's suppose you landed. You are a stranger to this city. You are a visitor. You landed from your station, Chalan Bazaar. Chalan Bazaar is a downtown line. Downtown line. It is the downtown line. So this is the one I landed, and I'm staying closer to. 
And uh, so that's the one that brought me up from all the way from the airport. Can you imagine? I I only got it here from three dollars, which in taxes would have cost me thirty to fifty dollars. Imagine that fifty to thirty to fifty dollars. And I didn't I only paid three dollars. And I think I have still S what is it called? S Linka. You buy S Linka and uh, S Link card is a, it's the way to go about. So now, what we have located, we just came out, for example. We just came out of that station and we are locating our mosque. Salam We just, yeah. It's like a deal, no one has it to do. And uh, everybody's so comfortable. Meaning, hey man, hey man, this is not. The West, we don't need anything from you. We got this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're cool, man. Yeah. You're okay. In the West, everyone is uncomfortable, lacking confidence in you. Every single day, you make me uncomfortable. And here, everybody seems to have everything they need, which is right, 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 right. So, I became a good at it and that was that. Mine over, not everything. So I brought my psychological work, Wolfer. Singapore. I think everybody is uh, like a child needed to be handed from the hand. And walk down to the street. That's how <laughs> what's the case? What's the um, so primarily Singapore I chosen it for deliberately because Singapore I hear is a bit just how they might be smart and they are very smart. Are they they are smart? Are they? Greetings, sir. You're welcome. You're welcome. Good to see you both. So, let's see how smart they are. Very much as far as I am concerned, they are okay. They are okay, smart. People are very uncomfortable. Have you noticed since the advent of technology and since the living, people have started to become uncomfortable, fidgeting, constantly fidgeting. It's like that. You think I got it all? I can do And then, I have anything. I am a self made. Literally came out of a textbook, reading a lot, trying to go by. Yeah. So, in my blind death, so, so let's suppose, anyway, that's me and Singapore. Because Singapore, make no mistake, is uh, our commonwealth our commonwealth country. Singapore is commonwealth. As a British citizen, they are my, they, they put the tea me. Yeah, I, like, I don't like sugar. So let's suppose you landed by saying, you're smart, you're very smart. That means you are smart and you don't need anybody. That is that makes its meaning, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. And, uh, and, uh, in the West, people automatically think we are living in the West, very rich. People are very uncomfortable, people are very busy, people are mental, mentally, mentally. And uh, to be honest with you, are uh, mentally 
psychologically scarred at the things in the West. In the West, and Europe, and America, and Britain. We, yeah, we're very, very, the, the wealth, very wealth. But that's what happened to the West. And look at the wealth here. People are very, Singapore is the wealthiest country in the world. I can assure you when people are kind, people are very much automatically kind, kind, kind. So, and, uh, and kindness automatically brings uh, healthiness. Healthiness, kindness, people are comfortable. So, you are invited. Greetings, my friend. So, you are invited from the other side of the world to come to have a look. Anyway, it's Asr's time. And, uh, you are becoming like the devil. A'udhu billahi minash shaitan rajeem. Cast the baby. And it's an Asr time. And I haven't missed the prayer yet. It's one of the things that I see blessing when I travel is to pray in the mosque. To supplicate. And uh, that's how we, as a Muslim, you can say. So you locate. So therefore, you come out of a Chalam Bizar, for example. So I located. The closest mosque there is somebody to before you even had the hotel. Because if you do not break some things, we do not play with as a Muslims. You might be having a hard day, but I can assure you, hard day or not, Allah expects you to fulfill his obligation. For your own benefit, the good we do for ourselves. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Bismillah wa salatu wa salam ala rasulim. Allahumma aftah liya ba wa rahmatuh. This is our mosque. And Abdul Ghafoor, Masjid al Abdul Ghafoor. And closer to Chalam Bissar. Chalam Bissar, you come out, and there is a lot of mosques because Islam is the second largest religion in. Singapore. Sir? So? Okay. Masjid Al Abdul Qafur. So I located it, Alhamdulillah. This is where I pray and eat. So it's Asr time. And I. Bismillah wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulullah. Okay. Assalamu alaikum, brother. Jazakallah khair. Jazakallah khair. My brothers. And she was put it there.
So there is a, a renovation going on in the mosque. And if you are uh, watching this video and you intending to contribute, may Allah reward you. And uh, Mr. Abdul Qafur, it is a Raikan Ramadan Kali in Parsama Master Masjid Kita Sakara Physical a 2D Ruang Mayar. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate this Ramadan with our mosque with the physical and virtual faith spaces. To me. To Naikan Sakat. So, Muslim, you can find all the information. Salam, Muslim, not Singapore SG. Salam SG. This is where I breakfast and uh, it's almost as of time.
صلاة العصر صلاة العصر 